Hi, this is Ralph Wilson with Web Marketing Today. I'm here in San Francisco at the eMetrics Web Marketing Optimization Summit with Matt Bailey. And uh, Matt's an, an analytics guy. And I've heard this story that you tell about Star Trek, and yes. I must hear the story, <laughs> that, that relates to segmenting our, our data. Now, yes. So tell me the story. Well, it was really a, I, I was looking for a metaphor to teach people the importance of segmenting their data, meaning we can't look at a, a, a panel on our analytics reports that say we had so many visitors and the average time they stayed was this long and it just doesn't tell the story because people come to your okay. site looking for different things. So what a, what they use a different Star words. Trek okay, it's Star this. Trek's coming. Oh, okay, all right. They use different okay, words right. in order to find what they need on your site. So that came from the principle, and actually John Marshall said it, that you can't treat your visitors like cattle. We're, we're not a group or a herd moving from one point to the other. So I realized, being a fan of Star Trek, I love the, I love the shows, the old Star Trek. Yeah. And there was always the joke about the red shirts were the first ones to die. Well, I, I sat down and started going through the data from each episode, and we counted up how many red shirts died. And at that point, I'm, it realized, it dawned on me that I have data, but I don't have proof. And so we went back and we added up, well, how many blue shirts died? How many yellow shirts died? How many red shirts died? And, and we realized now that, okay, we've got information. Did you do this for a client? No, this oh. was actually, <laughs> this was actually just uh, my own spare time. Oh, okay. We found out that red shirts died 78% of the time. And the blue shirts were about 8%, yellow shirts were 12%. And, but at that point, we were just beginning to segment the information. And we realized that, yes, it's true, red shirts die most of the time. But then, if you want to get actionable data out of that, you have to understand, well, what factors caused red shirts to die mm -hmm. at a higher rate than the other crew okay. members? And what we found was when red shirts beamed down to the planet's surface with Captain Kirk, almost 60% of the time, they were going to die. Boy, high risk. Exactly. And so that's the factor that increases our conversion rate, so to speak. <laughs> but then... Death rate. Exactly. Like Go ahead. exactly. Go ahead. But then if you wanted to improve the survival rate of the red shirts, what we found is that in the episodes where Captain Kirk meets an alien woman, the red shirt survival rate goes up 85%. Wow. And so... So bring them on. Exactly. So now we know the factors that will increase the death rate of the red shirts and decrease the death rate the death rate of the red shirts and that's how i apply it to web analytics yeah what is the world does this have to do with web <laughs> analytics now let's bring it home because when you segment your data you understand you're looking at different groups of people and you all of a sudden you start to see tendencies of what may cause this group to have a higher conversion rate than another group and so you can apply these changes to your website to bring that conversion rate up for other groups yeah. And only by looking at the groups and comparing what happens, okay. you can begin to understand some of the significance that's going on. Are people finding what they're looking for? If not, what are they doing? Mm -hmm. Where do they come in on the site? Where do you go on the internet to find a Klingon woman? <laughs> you know, it's not hard, and if you search for Alien Green Woman, you'll find my website because it's an article on my blog. <laughs> well, Matt, tell me about your business and what you do. Uh, I'm the uh, president and founder of SiteLogic, internet marketing consultants. We teach people how to take control of their websites uh, so that it's not intimidating. Okay, thanks so much. Thank this you. is Ralph Wilson with Web Marketing Today. Beam me up, Scotty. <laughs>